Hello guys and welcome to the next episode of Avon Colony. So we said that next we were going to work on one of the sandbox missions. So let me load up the new game here and we're going to go with Hylas Crescent because we didn't actually manage to finish that mission, did we, before? Here we go. So we're going to do this one as a mission sandbox. I'm wondering whether just to leave this as it is. Environment events normal. Mission objectives population growth. So I'm assuming that's going to give us targets to reach a certain growth. So that's okay. Morale, medium, morale, referendums, normal cargo pods, resupply pods, none. Yeah, that'll be good. Because that's sort of, um, when you get a resupply pod, that's when you're normally having lots of problems. So they send you a resupply pod. So we're going to try and do without those. We'll keep it basic. We did the mission before. And that was before the beta version was released. And uh, yeah, that didn't quite work out, did it? But... Here we go. This will work out well, I am sure. We're paused, I believe, at the moment. Game paused. Yep, there we go. Let's I hope read. You're keeping the happiness of your colonists in mind as you grow your colony. Remember, so, we're all in this together. Yes, we are, as you're up there on your shiny spaceship with your jaunty pose. Okay, so we're going to get some quinoa, some nanites, reach a population of 50. This will be interesting, actually, because... I haven't played this in about a week and a half. I pre-recorded quite a lot ahead. And what have we got here? We've got solar panels, solar modules, storage modules. So trying to just off the bat. There we go. Oxygen regulations. Construction drone. Okay, so we can build anything we need. Let's take a look around, see what resources we've got. So trying to immediately think about what I need. Let's just get the game going. Okay, so air overlay is good. Resources, that's what I want to see what we've got nearby. So we've got a couple of potash deposits. That's handy. We have a geothermal vent, iron, and as we reach out further, we've got zorium, iron, lots of other things. I want to build all along here, try and get the colony as big as possible. At the moment, water's doing okay. Food variety is low. That's something I want you to check. Yeah, people are happy-ish. What's their problem? Let's see. Uh, crowding, food, unemployment. Yeah, that's fine. We've got a lot of people. 69% unemployed. And I want you to check this one here. Crops overlay. Well, that one looks good. Melon. So let's get... Let's get a greenhouse going. 21 nanites. Yep, that's fine. And actually, before I do that, I'm going to grow that out there. I think this looks like a good spot for a greenhouse. 6 right an hour, 6.8. Maybe just butt that right up to there. 2, 3, it's changed. Why is it saying rice? I don't have rice selected. I have melons. There we go. That's more like it. So let's go with that. We'll have that one there. These you can't remove still, can you? You can't recycle them. No, okay. In the latest update as well, people will only travel 24 blocks for work, which is worth keeping in mind. Uh, housing used, 100%. Okay. So we need to get some more housing in. Just wondering what have we got. Let's have a quick look at this again. No, not air, resources. So potash there. Iron deposit over there, so at some point we're going to have to build and get to that. I'm going to build that one out there. There we go, that's working nicely. And I want to get my nanite production going first before that becomes a problem. So we'll get a mine on there. There we go. Oh, insufficient power. Okay, well that's okay. We can get a geothermal vent. Uh, let's just low production. Slow down, slow down. We'll put that on there. We'll have that as high. There we go. Get the power sorted. And then we should be fine. And then we'll get this one done. Then we've got another vent over there. We've got Zorium. So power shouldn't be a problem. And then I wanted to get the potash working as well. That was my other... Oh. After we've got this working. Let's get the nanite production first. We don't have a nanite producing building. No, we don't. So I want to put that sort of right next to this one. 
And then hopefully, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, they'll travel over there for that. That'll be fine. Average health, 99. Unemployed, 32%. That's going to change any minute. There we go. And also what we can do is use steam recovery mode and that'll sort our water. Excellent. Good. And then let's get our potash going on here. There we go. Once they finish this over here, we'll get that back to high priority. Good, good. Oh, I see, because that was medium. It's gone over there to do that first. That's fine. So hopefully we've got enough people. Unemployment 0%. Jobs filled 51%. Okay, that's fine. Fine. Everything's fine. Fine, fine. And then we need to have a way to get people in, which is going to... Yeah, now we've got our nanite production going. That'll be good. Good, good, good. I'm just wondering whether to... I mean, where are we getting food from? We're only getting food from here. And we've got plus 2.2. The potash will be good once that's going. Does that count the nanite when you place it or when it's built? It must be when you place it. Otherwise, you could place 100 things and it would randomly get halfway through and say, Nope, can't build any more of that one. So, we need to have an immigration centre to allow people to come in. And I'm going to line that up opposite this geothermal doodad over here. We just had enough. So, now we can make nanites, we can get more people, we can fill the jobs. That's what I wanted to get going. Uh, what am I looking for? Air. So, air quality is okay. Once we've got a few more nanites going... We'll get some vents in here as well. Just around here. And we're going to have winter warning. Farms will not grow crops. Greenhouses at 50% rate. Solar structures, 50% power. Well, power's going to be okay. So I'm not too worried about that. Uh, we can upgrade this at some point. Oh, let's use potash in there. We could even upgrade that. Um, nine nanites, so maybe not. Oh, we need to get this finished. Mm -hmm. Oh, it is finished. What am I talking about? So there we go. It's working. Processing already. Good, good, good. Excellent. Now we're going to start having people come in. Three at a time. That'll be fine. Let's upgrade that. Seven, eight, nine, almost there. What are we getting? Three new colonists. Excellent. So we really need to get going with the colonists to get more people in. I'm just wondering whether... If I drop that... Uh, no, let's not drop that down. Let's leave that as it is. 78 out of 80. I bet we've got a lot... Uh, one person in there, three in there. Is that going to still start turning off the potash use? It is. Okay, let's wait until the potash builds up first. Plenty of stock of water. Um, yeah, power's going to sort of fluctuate a bit, isn't it? Until, yeah, more people work here. So that's fine. I was hoping to get a couple more people over here. Um, we can change that, can't we? No, we can't. Oh, what we can do... Oh, housing is a problem, isn't it? Housing capacity used 100%. We're going to have people coming in with nowhere to live. Uh, what do we need? 16 nanites for that. We've got 12. Let's speed this up a bit and get... Get a few more. And then I'm going to start building those down here. So we can start spreading up in this direction. What's that telling us? Insufficient housing. I know. Oh, we've got 16. Oh, and storage. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. So let's pop an apartment right here. Get that built. That will give us another 16. And then storage is 98% full. What do we need? Can we upgrade? No, we can't. We've got storage pods, haven't we? Um, I know we can 
take some of those apart, but I don't want to do that. 12 nanites. 26. Eek. So we might have to have a look at our storage and delete some water. Hopefully we'll last. We're still making 61 per hour. Let's do that just to give ourselves some more space. So it's the making of the nanites, which is going to be a problem. Cannot afford to upgrade. How much is this making? Let's see. So we've got 11 iron in stock. Okay, we've got some more people. Well, that's going to cost 8 nanites, so I think we're going to have to wait for that. Oh, power. Oh, there we go. Some more people moved in. Turn that off. That's still going to be plenty of water. And then what I could do? Nope. It's time for a referendum. Oh, referendum. Election. Right up it by person. Yeah, we just need loads more people to come in, don't we? Oh man, the storage full again. Good grief! We shouldn't be making as much water now, should we? Because I don't have a water pump. Has that got potash? Let's do some potash stuff. It's just basically the nanites. We want to build nanites as quick as possible. What is it that's taken up? Oh, it's melons. I've got ration packs. Oh, there we go. A mini storage depot. Let's slide that in. Oh, we could be building out that way, so I'm going to slide that in over here. There we go. Hi, boss. I've got some feedback to help guide you in the upcoming referendum. You don't have access to adequate health care and there's not enough water. Okay. Oh, that's been built. Excellent. Let's just slow things down a minute. So we've got more people coming in. We have space. Water, not so good. It says 40.3 per colonist, consumption 2.3 an hour. So we're not actually making any water at the moment, are we? So we probably could do with... Might open that up. Another couple. And then we can steam recover that way. That might be a good idea. We're getting a reasonable amount of population in anyway. So what are we doing at 11? Oh man, storage is going to be... The storage. Storage for people is going to be the thing. What does it say here? How is the capacity? 68... So where are we going to head out to? Let's maybe do a bit of planning here. Because we've got... Let's have a look. Keep doing the air one. Resources. So we can do another mine there for those. We've got another iron here. How much iron is this going to give us? So we've got a certain amount. 384. 500. I've consulted with the inhabitants oh. of the colony, and they've given me some feedback that might help you. I have to walk too far to get to my job. Okay, we could change that for melons. What else could it give us? 60%, 40%, 60%, 60%, 30%, 40, 60. Oh, I see. It's different for each one. 40, 60, 50. Drops down to 30. Oh, that drops even lower. See, melons is the best one. Thank you. We could try some rice for a while. Let's switch over to rice then. Winter is coming. What are we up to? 22 people? Is that Why has that not gone up? It must have gone up. 25. Yeah, there we go. So we're going to need to build more apartments. We can't upgrade those. Habitats would be good. Let's undo that slot there. Because then we can upgrade that to larger habitats. Is that our biggest need at the moment? Um, I would think so. We're at 78%. Probably not just yet. get more power from there. I've got another potash there. I'm trying to decide what to go for next. Really just want more people, don't we? 
I'll tell you what would be good. If we get a water pump in, where's a good spot for water? 0 0.9, 0 0.8, 0 0.8, 0 0.8, 0 0.9. There's a 0.9 there. Although we don't have a path going that way, do we? Yeah, let's do that then. 0.9. Which just gives us the most. And I can turn off that once this is going. And we're going to need more food as well. Oh my goodness. We'll be fine though. We'll survive. There's a referendum election coming up soon. And I have some feedback from your colonists. Do you now? Let's have a look around. Yeah, everybody seems okay. Okay, right. We're getting water coming in. Let's turn that off there. Okay, that will do. Food's doing okay. Minus 4.3. But we should be fine. That that will kick in. Yeah, that will kick in when we need it. So, good. That's alright. What are we at population-wise? Still at 25. We've got... Oh. That's it. More people coming in. What I want is... I want that to be high... Oh, it's only 16. Is that 100%? Oh, we've got this one. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. I think they're more likely to work here. Yeah, there we go. We get this one as high occupancy. We'll now get 7 at a time. Phew, which is what we want to do. But farms and greenhouses and things, I think that is... We want to make sure... And storage... storage first because we're going to make all these things and then we're going to run out of places to store it so let's plop one of those in it may even be we can get rid of that and it'll all go into here just to free up some space then we can upgrade that 28 drones left just depleted so then if we upgrade this one as well to get extra potash. I think that will be helpful. How's our power? Power's fine. I thought barn grills were cheaper. 12 nanites. Slightly like increases air quality and entertainment morale. Um, how are they feeling? 50% jobs filled. Everyone's employed. 70% morale. They're wide about entertainment crowding and air quality. So with one of these, we could solve entertainment and air quality in one go, couldn't we? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are we at? 28. Got another 7 coming. Excellent. Storage has gone good. Okay. So we could maybe recycle this one. Recover 6 nanites. Imploding does not require drones. We'll not recover any nanites. The structure is storing all of that. These will be lost if there's inefficient storing capacity elsewhere. We have plenty of storage capacity. Congratulations on your referendum victory, boss. Yay! Ten new social policies. They need to have fun, health care, and air quality. Yeah, let's recycle that. And we're going to put a park in. How big is the park? The park is pretty big. Crisis detected. Let's plump the part there. What crisis? I see no crisis. Maybe there was a crisis and it got solved. <laughs> solved immediately. No idea what that crisis was. Okay, so that's been upgraded. That could be upgraded again. I think that's worth doing. That can be upgraded to go faster, but do we have enough iron? No, we don't. So we need to upgrade this one first. There we go. Excellent. Oh, it's doing the upgrades before it does the other things. That's fine. Plenty of power. Yeah, we don't want any more people in there. Storage is fine and we can upgrade that. Oh, I think we've suddenly got ourselves on an even keel. We're doing okay. The air is a problem. 
I'm wondering how much once this park has been built. Oh, it's been done. Look at that. Oh, lovely. Ah, oh, people are in there enjoying the park already. Look at that. Enjoy, enjoy. They just like walking around. Excellent. So how much is that going to help? 20 units of entertainment and morale in the surrounding areas. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, everybody seems happy. Insufficient housing. That's fine. We can... Oh, I can't upgrade that. Alright, we're going to stretch out this way. There we go. And then we're going to put housing here. We're 100% full. We are. Oh my goodness, we need 32 nanites. Okay, get, get building that. We're going to put some housing up here somewhere. Let's check the air quality now that we've put this in as well. 75, 75. It's pretty bad, isn't it? We're going to have to be careful. Let's add an intake fan. Over here. Yep, they've built that. Let's... What do we need? 16 power. That's fine. 32 nanites. Oh my goodness me. 16 nanites. Uh, let's speed things up. Yeah, I know. We're going to have... Can we deactivate that? No. What happens to the people that are coming in? See, look. That's brought in another seven people. So, do they not stay? Because there's nothing here to say homeless, is there? So, I don't know what happens with that. Oh, there we go. Let's slow down. We can build. Um, I'm going to leave a gap between there. And we're going to go here with that one. Fantastic. Yeah, so I don't know if they wander around homelessly or what. So I've, I've no idea. How's water doing? It says good. So, we'll be happy with that. We need to start doing training as well. Potash 67. Let's use potash in there. Another farm over here. Although we're making enough food, so maybe not at the moment. Let's only build when we actually need to build. Let's not... Oh, I know what I wanted to check. It was the commute overlay. Anybody complaining about a commute? No. Crime? Minimal, 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 minimal. So crime's okay. There we go. Look at that. Lovely. We can just build a path down there so they can get over here easily. In fact, oh, oh we're out of nanites. So I'm pressing the space bar wondering why it's not letting me build anymore. What did this take? Two nanites each. Okay, power. Let's unlock that. That's good. These also take power as well, don't they? They require one power for every one of these. Whoops. There we go. So what's that done? Yep, housing capacity 57%. We can now get another 31 inhabitants, which is more than enough to reach our target. Let's speed things up a bit. Get seven coming at a time. We're going to reach this target in no time at all. Can I upgrade that again? I can. How's our iron doing? We're still not making more iron than we're using, so... Let's have a look. Is that upgraded all the way? It is. Until that number starts getting up into a plus. What are we at? 46. One more dropship. And we hit our first target of 50. We're almost there. Six left, so the next dropship will do that for us. I'm wondering whether... I mean, I want to get ahead on the food. But at the minute, we don't have enough jobs. Jobs filled 77%. Yes, we've done the objective. We get some nanites and quinoa. Well done. I'm pleased with the progress of hmm. your colony. You may select one of the following... I'm going to take the nanites. Thank you very much. Now we're going to have a new mission to get to 100. From the inhabitants of the colony. And we get nanites and pasta. Okay, excellent. That's fine. Well, we know that's the targets we're going to get. Uh, going to get, but that means we're going to. That's going to help us to spread out. We've got another iron deposit there. Maybe we need to look to that one. 
There's still some more iron, but not much left. So we don't want to run out of iron. So I'm thinking we're going to build this out here. Or this one here. This one here, I think. Oh, and then we're going to have to get drones. Yeah, so we need to sort of think ahead here what we're doing. Right, that sounds like a good start to me. We've reached the 50 population. What do you think I should concentrate on next? Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. Um, and tell me how you are having fun with this game as well. I know this is now available to you guys as a public beta on itch.io. Um, so I'll try and put a link to that in the description below for you. Because I think I've got it linked on Steam, which you can't get yet. But you can get it on itch.io and you can check the game out for yourself. If you've got it, yeah, let me know in the comments. And don't forget to hit subscribe if you're new to my channel as well. We regularly take a look at indie games. Every single day there's always new stuff. Well, this has gone up. Not too bad. Let's upgrade this as well then. And I will see you guys tomorrow for the next episode of Avon Colony. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.